Mikola's Hallig Tree. Oh, Mikola. Oh, boy. I hear him blowing the horn already. This area is pretty cool. Are you just saying that? Okay, so this this thing up here on the map is the Hallig Tree. That's what I kind of thought. And now we've confirmed. Right off the bat, must sit. Or at least must activate. I don't like that this guy's spitting bubbles at me immediately. Also, don't fall immediately. Jesus Christ. Why you gotta put enemies right where you start? Like, right where you start and there's a fucking bonfire, man. Stop it. Projectiles and narrow paths. The best setup ever, am I right? Sacramental bud for the win. Yeah, you can see why it's BS immediately. I agree. Oh, God. How hot is it out here? Like, how hot is it where I live right now? Um, it's actually not hot, too hot right at this moment because it's only 11 a.m. But it will get hotter. I'm, should I sit at that point? You, know, you know what? I will because I don't want to lose all these runes. I don't want to give DJ a heart attack. I have at least a level up, so let's just do it. For DJ's heart and health, I will use some of these runes. <laughs> I only have enough for one, although I'm close to another one. Um, I was working on my strength to 60. That's already done. So I think I was doing dexterity now because it was still giving me a little bit of an attack boost. Although I think I had discussed with Morrow, and she was saying that maybe working on strength to 80, or at least until when I get a strength bump, it stops giving me a strength bump is a good idea. But I'll go dex 30, and then I'll think about it again. If it isn't hot, you just need to spit a few bars. Yeah, dude. Hot like fire. You know what? I'll kill a few more of these guys till I have enough for another level up since I'm close. Why do you need to do that, Flammy? That doesn't sound very nice. How close is that? I think I needed 14 something, right? Or 140 something, rather. They're just tooting their horn. Well, they're about to get tooting kabooting off of this level. Oh, see ya. You're gentle. It's more like friendly ribbing. Well, sometimes it doesn't come across as friendly ribbing. I'm not going to lie. Maybe you should be careful of that sometimes. Man, I don't want to drop down there and then I can't get back up. Also, damn it, there's ants here too. Oof, okay. I'm actually going to go sit one more time. and let, So they respawn so I can get... I just need one more little bit of runes. And I don't mind killing one more to do that real quick. You gonna go try to sleep again, Meg? All right. Well, thanks for popping in for just just to say hi. I'm sorry you can't sleep. Hopefully you're able to fall asleep now. Maybe I bored you enough to to sleep. That'd be that'd be an accomplishment. You're welcome. <sighs> well, that's why you were banned from things. But you know, yeah. I mean, we do know. We do. But again. You just got to be wary of the of, of the people you're talking to. Read the room, Flammy. Read the room. Are these fungi growing from the tree? It seems like it. It seems like it. All right. Well, let's move on, shall we? It's time to start exploring. We've used up the rune so DJ can breathe easy now. Exhale. Exhale, DJ. Exhale. Let me kill these dudes who are probably going to start shooting shit at me. I'm not a fan. I don't want them to shoot shit at me while I'm fighting other dudes, you know? Like, well, I'm start if I start moving on and they start shooting at me from afar, I'm going to be salty about it. I'm not boring, Meg. Thank you for saying that. I was just obviously joking. I'd like to believe that something about this stream made you sleepy again. And hopefully you'll actually be able to sleep. Let's just put it that way. <laughs> Bye bye. Okay, do I want to drop here or do I want to drop? Oh, you can't really drop over there. Oh, you can get back. 
I didn't even see this little side path down here. Is there an item down there? I don't see one. So you can't get back. You're not stuck if you move on. Okay. I didn't see that path before. You're not really a fan of the game. You're here for me specifically, Flammy. Well, I appreciate that, man. Anybody who's here for me and not the game, I really do appreciate you a lot. Because, man, I'm just a man playing video games, trying to have a good time. Can't always play the video game that everybody wants to watch. But at the very least, I can try to at least be entertaining enough to make you stick around anyways. That's all I can do. And if you just like failure and me freaking out when things go wrong, I mean, this is the right game for that kind of situation to happen a lot. Damn it. Oh my god, so much damage. What the hell? Oh, oh I'm not making that jump. So, like, I might have almost made the jump. <laughs> that was a little wider than I expected. Ooh, that jump did not work. Yeah, see, Sparty, he keeps it real. He's here not for me, but the game itself. So I need to just shut the fuck up just for Sparty's sake, okay, guys? God damn it, man. I'm mad. You love MMOs, Flammy? Well, you already know I'm not an MMO guy, so the fact that you hang around is a miracle already. I'm a little salty that I tried to make that jump. I didn't realize how far of a gap that was, though. It's my own, my own fault for depth perception failing me, really. I panicked because I was I, I heard shots coming at me, and one shot almost killed me in one hit. Or it took out half my health in one hit. Anyways, it didn't kill me, but half health in one hit means one more hit I will die. So I had to keep moving. I'm not even sure who shot that shit at me. The one that almost killed me. Was it one of those dudes over there? Like, I don't even know who got me with that shit. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh. I'm not 100% sure. Oh, I can go down here. Never mind. Woo! Projectiles for the loose. Again, I don't know who's shooting all these, but no thank you. Oh, God. I didn't even see that plant. Who the fuck is doing that shit? Stop it. Is there a big old plant monster up there or something? Fuck off, bro. Okay. This part sucks. In case you haven't tell couldn't tell. Oh, no. I missed. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. Whew. Breather? Breather. Okay. That thing looks like a wicked snowman. Kinda, yeah. You don't play them those not because they're bad, but just because of how much time you need to invest. I kind of agree. Those things look like something out of the mummy. Some kind of mummy, like, wrapped in a lot of cloth. Interesting. Nah, I'm... Trust me, Flammy. We're going to go back to Final Fantasy XIV. I'm waiting for the next patch. I think you heard me talk about that last night with Mario. We're waiting for the next full patch. Once that comes out, we'll come back and we'll do the next patch and maybe some other stuff. But I'm waiting on that right now. Right, I'm not getting shot at right now. I want to go back up here real quick and see what else was up here. Uh, besides getting shot at by... Who the fuck is shooting at me? Where's that coming from? Ah, I don't know where that's coming from. It's annoying me, though. Damn it, I missed. Ugh. Where is that coming from? Stop it. It's coming from above, but I'm like, I don't know where. <laughs> Whatever, just keep moving. Let's just get up there, fuckers. Keep moving. Keep moving. Never stop, never stopping. Oh my god, there's so many of these guys up here. It's so annoying. 
This place is too treacherous, man. Oh my god. Could you, like, not be stuck behind a little fucking notch in the ground that I can't get by, apparently? No item over there? Oh, there is an item over there. There's a plant that I'm going to ignore. See ya. Son of a bitch. Sip. My god, this is so fucking treacherous. Fucker. Sip, sip, sip. Whew. Okay. Wow, stone sword key that I totally don't need at this point. Cool. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. I'm just trying to explore up here because once I go down further, I'm not going to want to come back up here. Deserving boluses. I'm trying to get everything up here that I can see. You know what I mean? All right, these fuckers are the ones doing all. The I mean, I, I did see there's a bigger plant dude over there. Just trying to be careful about everything here. I don't know if the plant's worth killing though. You know? At least this doesn't have Castlevania knockback. If it did, fuck this whole part. I wouldn't even I wouldn't even bother. I would run past everything and I wouldn't even bother. I'm not gonna lie. I really wish this is one of those situations where it's like, I wish I had magic just so I could fuck this guy up from afar. Sip. Cause he's gonna take so much damage to kill. He doesn't seem like he has an item, though. I don't... You know what? I'm not going to bother with him. I'm not. I'm not going to bother. Did I get all the items along the way here? I hope so, because I'm kind of over it, and I'm going to work my way back down now. I didn't go up to where those one ants were crawling up, though. Like, up there? I didn't go all the way up there. There's definitely more guys up there. Did I kill all the fuckers who were shooting at me along the way, though? I think I did. All right, let's jump back down here. And I'm going to get on this path right here. Whee! That was pretty far, but it didn't hurt, so that's good. This is the last, like, set of these parts I want to check before I go down instead of up. So let's get this fucker up here. Oh, that's a bigger boy than I thought it was. Get him. That's a big boy. Get him. Holy shit. A way bigger boy than I thought. Holy fuck. Oh shit, his reach is way further than I thought. I didn't even know y'all could get this big. Oh god. Kill him. Was that worth killing? I don't know what he would have done if I didn't kill him. Like, if he would have shot at me or whatever. But he had an item, so let's see what it was. Envoy Crown. Okay. Probably looks silly wearing that, but hey, whatever. Okay, so the ants are on their way up here. Oh, God. Let me let the ants come to me so I don't have to deal with the fucking dude down there. The ants are not really that... While they are scary in theory, they don't terrify me as an actual enemy because they're not that hard. Not if they're not the flying one anyway. The flying ones are more terrifying. And also, sorry if I'm not reading chat right now. This place is way too treacherous to get distracted. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I will come back to chat when I feel like I have a moment, you know? This place is not giving me said moment right now. Holy shit. This bro up here. Not okay. That magic wrecked my shit. Oh, God. What the hell kind of shit was that? No, 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 no. Not okay. Not okay. Boy, you can't be flying around like that. Fuckface. Envoy's long horn. Is that his weapon he dropped? Dappled cured meat? That's cool. 
There better be a fucking item at the edge of the end of this fucking path, because what the heck, man. Smithing stone eight, okay. Okay, so this is the path that leads back to where the... Yeah, 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 okay, okay. That leads back to the beginning, where I started. Okay. So I think we cleared out this whole upper section that I can see. I'm not sure if I missed anything, but I feel like I did a pretty good job, honestly. Oh, shit, there's still that path over there. Well, shit, never mind. I still have one more path. <laughs> Came for funky, stayed for the dappled cured meat. Exactly. It's very dapper. The dapply dappered. Overcompensating much for that with that long horn, am I right? When the game is being very intensive and chat is really active, I don't expect you to keep up. Yeah, exactly. Thank you for saying that, because it is true. And I don't and I don't expect you to expect me to keep up. I'm just pointing out that I feel bad because I want to know what you guys are talking about. But again, this is the kind of shit where it's like every moment is tense because I could just fuck up and fall at any moment. And I don't like it. Expectations lead to disappointment. Exactly. Okay, that seems to be the way that I'm supposed to go. Let me let me do this last branch here. Clear it out. I know there's more dudes up here. I did see an item over there. Let's get it. Man, the amount of damage these bubbles do is absurd. I'd love it if this guy chased me all the way down. That'd be dope. I would be okay with this. I just didn't want to over-pursue and get jumped there with bubbles, you know? Fuck this guy and his goddamn leaping bubble homing attack. I'm not a fan. I know, dodging backwards on these branches, it is very treacherous, but hey, I'm making it work, man. It's just understanding your surroundings, realizing what you're capable of. Fuck you! Yes! Fuck yo shit. See ya. Okay, I feel good about that. I know we only have one sip left, but like... I feel like that I got uh, that the fact that I came all the way up here or came all the way down here rather. Prattling pate, my beloved. Really? My beloved. That's amazing. I'm happy. I'm really happy I found that actually. <laughs> you know where I'm gonna who I'm gonna drop that one on later. We should test it out to see what it sounds like. I agree. I want to hear it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're going to toss that one around a little bit later. You know who's probably going to come through later. <laughs> Love it. If that dude chased you all the way down, things never said by a person in an empty parking lot. Yeah. Chase me all the way down. See what happens, son. I'm going to sip this wondrous physic flask because why not? Okay. I feel good about this. Ah, oh, shit. The fat boy. He's... Oh, he's shooting big bubbles. The big boy. Okay, I wasn't expecting him to... Now we know what the big fat one can do. Oh, I'm gonna get Scarlet Rotted. That's bad. Oh, that's bad. Is it worth it for not dying? Probably. Am I in a safe spot so I can eat my bolus? God, I hope so. No, that's blood loss. Shit. That's not Scarlet Rot. This one. Ah. Okay, we're good. Luckily, I have a bunch. That was dangerous. I'm glad I'm just ignoring you, but that's also a sign you're gone too far. I don't... Sorry, it's hard to... Ca Did you not hear what we just said, Blammy? It's hard for me to get all the chat right now. This is fucking intense shit. Don't be a... Don't be... A, don't be that guy right now. That's what I'm saying. Like, come on, man. Don't make me feel bad that I haven't read all the chat, because I know I haven't, and I, ha and I said I won't be able to. Okay, so do I have to... Oh, there's a ladder. Thank God. I was about to say, do I have to just jump down? Never mind.
Thank God there's a fucking grace. Hail Mary, full of grace. Just what I need before I die. Because I was about to fucking run out of flasks, man. In fact, I am. Oh, no, I have one left. Whoo! I do have a talisman to regenerate HP. I think you are correct. I'm pretty sure I have that, DJ. Which one it is, I couldn't tell you. But I'm pretty sure I have it. Yeah, there you go. Blessed. Blessed do. So, Flammy, when you say you're pretty far gone, does that mean you have had a few, uh, few drinks today? Are you a little inebriated, sir? Is that what you're implying by saying you're far gone? I should sit. What am I doing? All right. Well, not quite enough for a level up yet, but close. You've had a bunch of wine. There you go. Now you guys know why Flammy's, you know, why, where the personality's coming from today. It's, we're on the wine, we're on wine Flammy day. All right. Got it. Noted. Wait, I didn't see this switch before. Oh, shortcut for later, I see. Okay. All right, Halleck Tree. Part, Halleck Tree Part 1 complete. We'll just say that because we made it to one, from one grace to the next. And I even cleared out the whole upper area, too, like of, of its items, as far as I'm concerned, anyways. Oh, he came in too hot. I wasn't ready. Welcome to hell. Strong words from a guy named Purgatory Potato. Oh, hello. You just drop out from the sky, sir? Okay, I'm trapped. I, I can't move, and I'm dead. I He got me wedged in there, and I couldn't move, and then he knocked me off anyways. Ah! <laughs> and then he fell off and died, idiot. That was cool. Yeah, he hit me with that Soul Calibur. Ring out! He did. He did, man. What a fuck. Damn, motherfucker got a fucking clothesline in midair. Get it, get it. So that dude just came raining down. Where the fuck did he come from? And does he respawn? Because he totally killed himself. Okay, I don't know if he actually died last time then. God, this location for this guy is ass. Why would you want to fight him here? This is a terrible spot. Holy shit. God, his leaping ability. Damn it! I thought I was gonna get him. Ah! One hit! One hit! What a fuck. <sighs> Son of a bitch. You have enough points. For three redeems, DJ? How the f... Man, you are here too much, sir. <laughs> Not that I'm mad about it. I'm just like, wow, you have a lot of points. Did the big man drop down already? There he is. Wow, he just rains down from the sky. What an asshole. Flammy's 18k points away. Nice. Anyway, T said he's playing some WWE right now. They have some taunt called the funky one. Yeah, man. They mo -cap, they mo -cap me for that. I I didn't want to I didn't want to let everybody know that. Where do you think I get all my royalties? 
I blocked that. I blocked that. I had my shield up and it didn't even tink off of it or nothing. It just hit me instead. That was lame. Ugh. Ugh. But yeah, you are correct, DJ. I will probably work on the uh, Celeste stuff after I move, yes. Oh, by the way, for those of you who haven't already heard, I know there's a few people here who don't show up here during the week. Um, I am moving. I will be moving. I'm actually going to move to Ohio. And if y'all don't already know why, then, wow, where have y'all been? But yes, uh, basically I'm moving in with Mara. Uh... We have a house we already rented, and I'm just moving into there from here. And, uh, yeah. That's the plan. Am I ready for those winters? I mean, I've already been there in the winter, to be fair, T. So I know how cold it gets. Um, but, yeah. Moving over there. Um, it's 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 semi-temporary. I mean, I'm going to be there for at least... No, nah, I'm going to be there for at least probably the year. But the plan is ultimately to move back to California later. It's not that she doesn't want to, Sparty. It's just there's other circumstances that doesn't allow her to move at the moment. So we're just, you know, going with the easier situation first, which is I'll just move over there for now. <clears throat> so now. Is this guy not going to appear again? Like, what the fuck? Hello? He decided he didn't want to come down. Hello? How cold does it get over in uh, Ohio? I mean, below freezing? It snows? <laughs> I've been there for both of those things. I haven't gotten snowed in, but I've it's been snowing when I was there, for sure. Well, I don't know where the fuck this guy's at, but yeah. One day you'll see some snow. I mean, if you go to Canada like you were thinking about doing, DJ, you'll definitely see some snow. <laughs> Wait, was it you that was thinking about going to Canada, DJ? No, I don't remember if that was you or not. Wow. <laughs> wow, T. I don't know if I would do that whether it was cold or not, but if you did it, I suppose that's true. That was you who mentioned Canada. Okay. I thought I remembered that. For some reason, it was in my head. So it must. I was like, I figured it had to be you. Oh, look, a bunch of guys who want to hit me before I get up there. That's cool. Why didn't that Leo guy spawn? What the hell? I don't understand. Wow, he fell. Okay. That's actually what I was hoping would happen. Is that one of these dudes would fall down? Bye-bye. If I ever come over there, you'll treat me to some drinks, lunch, and a sauna. I mean, I do have hopes and hopes to visit Europe at some point. I don't know exactly which countries are on my top. Of, well, I do know which countries are top of my list, but I don't really know which one of those. I have to remember which ones you guys live in. Like Italy, Spain are probably two of my top. I'm not going to lie. And I know of those two, I only know Rio lives in Italy. Also, Dandy, what's up, man? Welcome in, welcome in. Didn't know I started early. Yep. You were busy playing the game yourself? Yeah, I've been playing for about, what, a little bit over an hour now. Just got to the Hallig Tree about 20-plus mm, minutes ago. Just got past the first, to the first grace, or the second grace, I guess you could say. And now I'm just taking it slow exploring. Italy and Spain are some of the best places to go. Well, those are two, my top two for, for Europe. Obviously, I also want to check out UK at some point. Um, Germany would be cool. Uh, I don't know. I don't really have... Uh, oh, Amsterdam. I definitely want to go to Amsterdam. Uh, definitely. Oh, yeah. You should have watched me do the whole assassin thing, Dandy. You missed it. I just... 
I, I, I made a path for myself and I just YOLO'd that shit. Also, the Leo guy, he's there. There he is. If I go to Amsterdam, you assume I'll peruse the red light district at night. That's like your favorite thing to do there. I mean, I at least have to see what it looks like. Even if I don't partake because of obvious reasons. Still got to know what it looks like. Oh my god, that didn't hurt me. What the hell? Okay, I'm not mad at that. Why didn't the dude get aggroed and come down? Go there at night, not during the day. Oh, I'm sure it looks better at night. Red light district. That's why you get the red lights at night, man. Can I, like, throw something at this fool? I don't really have a bow equipped right now. Let's equip something to throw at his ass. I got throwing knives or something. Yeah, hell yeah. Let's throw some... Uh, yeah, let's throw some fucking kukris at this bitch. To be fair, the Albanark archers on the rooftops are worse than the invisible black knife assassins. I actually handled them pretty decently, to be fair. But they were worse, I agree. They freaking just rain down arrows on you. Some people go to the red light district during the day and it's just dead. That would, would be boring, but yeah. Some shopkeeper in Amsterdam schools you on how to buy edible slammy. Nice. Eat it. Oh, God. He made it. Ah. Bye-bye. Oh, he killed me. No. Wow. I should have just dropped. Why didn't I just drop? I can live on that drop. I already dropped down there twice. Son of a bitch. That guy is not a joke, man. He hits so hard. I almost had him, like, twice already, but he keeps fucking being an asshole. And then he didn't even come down that time. What a fuck. I was waiting for him, and he didn't come down. What a fuck. It's like I want him to come down. I want to fight him down here. Come down here, you fuck. There he comes. Bitch. Oh, I missed. Ah, oh, I missed. I missed! Ah! Oh, God, I missed again. Oh, I missed again. Dude, I can't even get go get, a, get a, like, get a fucking fight going with this guy. Damn it, the wind-up. So annoying. I'm gonna get this guy. I'm gonna fucking get him. He's just so fucking annoying. <sighs> he hits so goddamn hard. I don't even care about the runes anymore at this point, if you can tell. Oh god, I forgot about you. I forgot about you. My bad. Honestly, you never even saw this big guy, DJ. You probably just ran past all this shit. That's why. I want the item that's up by him, though. I could just run away, I suppose, once he drops down. He's just... He's so fucking hot pursuit, you know? You'll never take me alive! Also, I'm getting raided! Oh, you're talking about the big bubble guy? You never saw him? Oh. No, don't hug me. Ah, dicks. Oh, my God. That did a lot of damage, and they tried to Scarlet Rot me. That's not cool. I'm going to make this jump. I'm going to make this jump. Ah! I'm getting double raided, and I'm distracted. Son of a bitch. The double raid coming in hot, y'all. What does it look like I'm doing? Anyway, you shouted out Dandy. Nice. Good shout out to Dandy. Anyway, you can hit an FML and Dragon with those shout outs now.
And there's a resub. Let's go. Okay. Hey. Hell yeah, dude. Thank Christ. Uh, hey, hey, hey. There's a socket Ooh. in its chest insert the city crest. I want a sec. Hollow Knight clip? Okay. Okay. I I'll do it now. Thank you guys for the raids, Dragon, so FML. How many more levels did you guys finish on Hollow Knight or Hollow Knight on Halo? Because I left <laughs> off and you guys were doing that Master <laughs> Chief level. Uh, the one, you were you were uh, you're on the one where you had to fight that boss. Did you guys finish that level? I'm assuming. And then did you do another one? Saw a also, oh Valheim clip, Valheim the clip. Fuck? In the meadows. Quarantine zone. Okay. Just watching me. It's possible. Five levels left or so. That's Hopefully you can finish it in your next sitting then. I will say level 10 is the hardest and longest level in the game. So, yeah. Quarantine Zone, I believe, is level 9. <sighs> okay, I'm just going to avoid fighting that dude. That, that fucking big sword guy. Sorry, I'm ignoring this clip. I don't know if that was... What was going on with that clip anyways? Oh my god, look how many of these fucking mushy guys there are. Jesus! Is there enough of y'all? Ha <laughs> ha! Another one. Oh god! I didn't know he was coming in for the hug! Ow, ow, ow! You're on 11 of 15 according to the mission thing? I will say if you guys didn't do... If you're on the quarantine zone level, you're on mission 9. I don't know what the mission numbers are. There's only 13 missions, so you're on mission nine, technically. I think they're like counting cutscenes as missions or something there. Anyway, get that pizza, FML. Pizza for the win, dude. I was thinking about what am I going to eat today. I was thinking about ordering food just in general, just because I was like, I don't know what I want to, I don't want to cook anything. And the things I do have that I could cook, I don't really want to eat today. So I was already con contemplating ordering some food today already. You got some Taco Bell in the fridge, Dandy? That's what you're going to eat? Hey, man. Do it. So, Taco Bell. Everybody's got a Taco Bell order. What's your Taco Bell order, Dandy? What's your go-to? What do you partake in from the Taco Bell? Frogs tell me to order some Greek food. Also, yo, welcome, Frog. Sorry, I didn't see you pop in there a minute ago. I've been a little preoccupied with the game, and the chat has been pretty cracking, so sorry if I miss anybody who may have popped in that I didn't say hi to, or I'm not saying enough, reading enough of your messages. <laughs> okay, DJ, you've never been to Taco Bell, so you don't have a Taco Bell order. I get it. I met people who go to Taco Bell. Get some souvlaki or moussaka. Are those both Greek things? Because I've never had either. Taco Bell best served in a waste basket. Got him. I don't really eat Taco Bell anymore myself. See, it's been a long time. For, like, I don't get it regularly. I think the last time I got it was because it was 2 in the morning and I there was, nothing else was open. And that was, like, six months ago. Anyway, Danny always gets the two beefy five-layer burritos. You, you get two of the beefy five-layer burritos and two soft taco supremes. There you go. I don't like the soft tacos. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a crunchy taco guy, at least from Taco Bell. Dragon got some Little Caesar with cheese sticks and some crazy sauce. All right. Frog hasn't had Taco Bell in 35 years, so you're all losing while Frog is over here winning. <laughs> Souvlaki is like a shish kebab. It's Greek style. Okay. I like, I like shish kebabs. Moussaka is like a lasagna, but with potatoes and feta cheese and eggplants. I hate eggplants, so not a that doesn't that one's not you're not selling me on that one very well. Oh, there's a fucking staircase. Oh, that just goes down the ladder. Okay, you know what? I might climb that ladder then. Well, yeah, homemade taco is better than any Taco Bell all day long. That's pretty much what I'm trying to say. I'm a I'm a homemade taco guy. You know this. We know this. This is not news. Eggplant is very weird. It's like it's like it almost has a texture of like you're trying to eat some kind of weird meaty thing, even though it's not, obviously. It's very strange. Not a fan. 
people like like to make this dish called eggplant parmesan which again if it didn't have eggplant maybe but i'm not a fan When you want to clear your rectum, you get a supreme burrito and a chicken quesadilla. Yes, yeah, see? Everybody's got a Taco Bell order if they go there at all. Even if you don't go there often, you got something you like to go there for when you do end up there. That's all I'm trying to say. Isn't that just Parmesan? I mean, it's not eggplant, which is Parmesan sprinkled on it, DJ. It's not what it is. It's more than just that, I'm pretty sure. I only use eggplants to denote penises that are gross. <laughs> I mean, that is what the people use it for these days. I didn't want to aggro both of them. I just wanted to aggro the beast dude, not the Leo guy. I wanted to aggro that fucker over there. Hello. Come to daddy. Come to daddy. Damn it. It's like, I didn't really hate these guys with the big sword that much, but this area it will make you hate them already just because of the location they're in and how you, the circumstances in which you have to fight them. So annoying. Well, let me hit him through the wall. Why not? Can I cheese this fool? Like, will he not come in here? Oh, God. Not if he's going to swipe me through the wall. Oh, he came in here. That's not what you wanted to see. Oh, God. He's coming right for us. Dude, bro. Oh, God. That plant down there tried to murder me. Motherfucker. If he can't come in this room, that would be really, really sweet. He doesn't seem to want to. That doesn't mean he can't. Nope, he totally can. I just had to invite him proper. Damn you and your spin to win. Ah! Running for my life! Ooh, that was worth picking up, though, for real. Yo, did he stop chasing? Because I'm okay with this. Oh, it's those guys. My bad. Whew. Ow. Yeah, those huge sweeping attacks are definitely what makes those big dudes, those Leo guys, hard. I agree. Um, I kind of wanted to go down there and go back up there and get whatever items are up there. I still want to. I'm just scared. But now that I'm clearing out this little particular area, I can probably go ahead and do it. And then just run past everything to get over here again. I'm just kind of seeing where this goes. <gasps> There's a grace. Yo, I'm about to at least activate this grace. I'm not going to sit at it yet, but I will activate it. Hell yeah, dude. Fucking bitchin'. Yeah, dude, plants having laser abilities? What? That's not normal in your in your neck of the woods? This kind of reminds you of Lothlorien from the Lord of the Rings movies or Rivendell. Yeah, I could see that. Definitely some, some elven shit going on here, it feels like. I don't know what happened to that guy. Did he fall off? Because that would be dope. I would be okay with this. Where the hell did he go? I didn't see myself get a big chunk of souls or anything. Did he fall off? He must have fell off, guys, because I don't see his ass. I don't know where he went, but I'm not mad at it. I'm not mad about it. That's for damn sure. 
I just wanted to go up here and see what was like. I know there's an item over here and there's some enemies, but I, hopefully there's not any like. Oh shit! One of these guys. Oh my god. Fuck! I got stuck. Couldn't move. Damn it. Damn it. At least I got a, a, a thing, right? Damn it. At least I got this. Going back isn't the most daunting thing now that I have this. I just wanted to get those items. I really don't care about my runes at this point. You knew a rabbit that could shoot ass at FML? That sounds pretty dope. Don't you shit! Don't you attack me, boy! You got knocked the fuck out. I did get knocked the fuck out, 100%, and it hurt. It hurt my soul. Well, that guy really didn't give a fuck about me. I'm just gonna leave him alone then. Fuck him. I mean, I have no reason to kill him if he's not guarding an item. Golden rune. If he's just gonna ignore me, I'm okay with this. like these guys aren't hard it's just the delay on their attack is just a fucking year and a half it's crazy a delay is so long what's my map looking like i'm actually i have the whole map uncovered uh dandy at least that i know of there's no more gray on my map Um, I kind of explained in the beginning. I, I actually uncovered the last part of the map off screen, but I didn't explore it, the area much. So I'm going to do that today after I do this area, of course. If I can do this area today. I mean, for all I know, this is all we're going to end up doing today because I'm going to be here a while. But so far, it's been going okay. Okay, so you can kind of shortcut your ass down here if you want to get to that, that grace, which is nice. Um... Yeah, okay, that's where the Leo dropped down. Okay, yeah, we're good. I just wanted to, like, make sure I got everything up here before I head further down. You know how I do. But, yeah, if you want to look at the map real quick... Well, I'm in territory where I can't right now, but I'll show, I'll show you the map when I can. In fact, let me just get over back to this grace, and I'll reset, and then I'll show you the map. Ah, uh, I think the Leo guy's chasing me. Oh, thank you. See, let me show you guys the map real quick. So obviously, yeah, we're up here in the Halic tree at the moment. Um, but yeah, I started, I actually uncovered this whole half of the map off screen. Particularly, I got these two graces. Actually, I think these three graces, the Freezing Lake, White Ridge Road, Giant's Great Post. Giant's Great Post is where I picked up the map for this last area that I didn't have uncovered. But yeah, now we have the whole map uncovered. So, there it is. Okay, so, now that we've done that, time to back, time to get back to exploring. There's definitely some shit down there. Oh, fucking take a shot on me from down there, you asshole. How dare you. God, this area is giant. But we're definitely working our way down to, like, the min middle center, I'm sure. Okay, so I can drop down and go down this little side tree. I kind of want to murder these ants and get whatever's over there. This game is giant? Yeah, no shit. Fuck it! YOLO! Regrets, I've had a few! Oh god, don't knock me off. Okay, maybe I'm regretting this a little bit just because they can knock me off. Oh, I could have walked down this way. It, let, it actually connected. Well then, now we know. Did I fight the bug in the meteor crater? The one on top of the mountain 
the one on top of this mountain over here. Uh, uh, sorry, over here, over here, over here, over here. Uh, the one on top of this mountain, Mount Gelmir. I did fight a big old bug dude up there, yes. I already fought one of those guys, though, so I didn't really care that I did it off screen. I fought one of those guys in a different fight. But yeah, if that's the bug you're talking about, yes, I did that. Oh, the grab, which I don't even know if I knew. Oh, my God. And, of course, he threw me off. I didn't even know those guys could do a grab move. That's the first time that's ever happened to me. Well, then. Well, then. Maybe I'll just grab the item and run. I don't really care that much. They're just the ant monsters. They're not going to drop anything. One wants to aggro. That's great. I can, I'm okay with this. One aggro at a time? Sign me up. That actually worked out that time. Whew. Yeah, you don't, if you haven't missed anything, if you're all caught up on all of my VODs and YouTube videos, which all my Elden Ring is posted at this point, um, then yeah, you haven't missed anything. I've definitely done a lot of random bosses off screen. Most of them have been repeats. I haven't done any unique bosses off screen. I can tell you that for sure. Every achievement that I've gotten has been on screen, I believe. I can't think of any that I did where I got an achievement off screen for a boss. All those ones have been done on screen. But yeah, any other like catacombs, extra dungeons and shit that I've done, none of them have resulted in anything unique, which I'm lucky that that has been the case. I've even done a few of the side quest things off screen where I like, you know, progress some of the side quests a little bit. Some of the NPC homies. But even those I don't usually finish off screen. And yes, FML, you beat up a shell of a man. You're so good. You're so good. Does that mean you beat the, um, like, the extra final mix boss? Which NPCs have I not done quest lines for or didn't finish? Um, the ones I know of that I haven't finished at this moment. Let's see if they're still on the map, because that would help me remember. Um... Where is he at? The Dung Eater isn't done yet. I need to find more of the things to give him to finish him, I think. The Noble Gold Mask, I believe there's still more to that one. I don't really know what's the next step on that one. The Death Root guy, yes, I still need to do that. Um, I actually might have a Death Root on me that I need to give him. I'm not 100% sure, but I might. Um, those are two for sure. And I think the girl with the prosthetic arm. I haven't finished her stuff. I don't know where she went after I last saw her, but that's the other girl I'm, I'm thinking that has a quest line that I started. Oh, and the girl that I gave the eagle summon to. I don't know where you, that one progresses either. Actually, I haven't been to the round table hold in a minute. We should do that when I get a chance today. When I'm done here or when I want to like go back and do something, I'm going to go to round table hold. Oh, they have the crystal guys here. Boo. I don't even think I beat that boss on, on my playthrough FML, but I didn't grind to get high enough level to do any of the hard stuff on my Kingdom Hearts Final Mix replay that I did a Let's Play of. I mean, I found Kenneth Height in the beginning of the game. Is he not back at his castle still? Because he was here. Is there more? Do I have to go back? And talk to him some more? Because I did his stuff a long time ago. If there's not more to his quest, then I don't know what you do. He said he was waiting for an heir or whatever, I believe. Or, or a rightful person, blah, blah, blah. I forget what he said. It was a long time ago. <sighs> the potion. I gave the Saluvis' potion to... I gave Saluvis' potion to uh, 
the guy in Roundtable Hold. Then I went back to Saluvis and found out he was already dead because I already can pro progress Ronnie's quest. So I fucked up on Saluvis. Saluvis died. Ripped to Saluvis. Oh, well. Um, apparently, he's tied to another quest. Okay, well, when I'm done here, we'll go, we'll go side quests. We'll do a little bit of side quest action. I mean, this is already side quest action as far as I know. Yeah. I said when I'm done here. You heard me. You can laugh, hurrah, huzzah all you want. I said what I said, motherfucker. Being done here doesn't mean beating this place. It just means when I'm done here. Fuck off. <laughs> Damn it, come over here. Let me fight you over here. I don't want to have to go over there. Come to me. Come to daddy. Oh, there's two of you? No, that's not what you want to see. That's not what you want to see. There you go. That's what daddy likes. Come to daddy. I don't know why I didn't block any of that when I had my shield up at first. It just like went over my head and hit me anyways. But that's cool. Dude, how many stabs? That was six stabs. That is too many stabs. Bro, you stab way too many times. I kind of don't want to even fight these guys. They're just... They take so many hits just to break their fucking armor. And then they're easy to kill. But, like, fuck those guys. How am I not hitting him? I don't get it. Let me just kill this slug thing. And not even worry about Crystal Boy over here. I definitely don't need to fight them. That's kind of what I figured. Also, did the Crystal guy kill himself? The other one? What happened to the other one? Also, I'm stuck. The spear guy chased me, but what happened to the other guy? Did he fall? He must have fell. That's pretty funny. Oh, God. What, am I being blind about something? Did he die when I killed his fucking slug friend? Is that what it was? I don't even know. At this point, I'm just looking around. Oh god, don't fall. Oh, he did die when I killed his little crystal slug friend. I see. Noted. I actually didn't even notice he exploded as I killed it. I didn't. I didn't see it. Now I know. Noted. All right, let the exploration continue then. Uh, spirit collar snails, what a bunch of dicks, am I right? I assume I can make this jump. This is treacherous as hell looking though. I don't like it. I'm just making sure this is my option right now. What else do I have, you know? It looks like this is where I'm going, so... I guess, fuck it. YOLO? YOLO! Whee! Oh, did not make it. Oh my. Okay, maybe that was the intention. Jesus. I did see the ledge down there. Did not think I was going to make that, though. <laughs> I hear a shiny boy, which is all well and good, but he sounds like he's inside. Ow. Really? You came in and hugged me as I finished killing your friend? That was not a cool, cool move, bro. Not cool. Absolutely. Not cool.
Don't you hug me. Don't you hug me. These guys are so fucking beefy, it's annoying. You, mush you mushy covered fucks. So, besides falling down, was there anything up here that I missed by falling? Oh, there's a whole little building situation underneath. How do I get into there? I want to go in there. Was there a way to go in there? I want to go in there. I'm scared to jump because I couldn't make the jump across the first time. There's a ladder, though. Smithing stone six. I guess we'll start with this ladder and see what happens. Alright, so this just leads up to... I guess back to where you can get back across. I'm assuming I can get in there from here, right? Am I going to do this right now? Okay, well I can get back across. Is there a way to drop down into there? Because that would be way more convenient... How many hours am I into this game? What is it, will I say this is the longest game I've ever played? Longest game I've ever played? No. But I have put a lot... It's the longest Souls game I've played. Because I've put way more hours into this than any other Souls game. Oh, okay. I made the jump that time. I feel like I could just make that jump. I'm about to just go for it. Because I want to know. I want to know! Woo! Mama! I just want to know. Would the longest game be Final Fantasy XIV? I mean, yes, because it's an MMO. If you want to call that the longest game, I suppose that is true, yes. I've definitely put more hours into that game than any other game, except for maybe RuneScape. But yeah, it looks like my Steam hours is up to 102 hours. A lot of that has not been streaming, though. Remember this. I have played this game a bunch on my own time. I've probably spent about two-thirds of that streaming it. I'm not sure it was worth jumping over here. Not see oh wait, there's a treasure chest. Maybe it was, maybe it was. Viridian Amber Medallion. Do I have the regular like plus one or plus zero? No pluses? I do. So that's the stamina one, huh? Okay. Wait, I don't have that equipped, do I? No, I don't. I have Strength Raise, Jump Attack, Stamina Creed, and more runes. I should switch this out. I don't really care about runes as much as, as I used to. How many hours did we say for Final Fantasy XIV? Was it like 360 or 80 or something? It was definitely more than anything else I've played. I don't remember the number exactly, DJ. Sorry. It's been a while. Because it like gave it to us in days, and we had to math it out. But yeah. It was a lot. It was definitely at least three plus more times in this game. Oh, my Pacross touch is 300 hours. Shut up. Although I will tell you this, DJ, with Pacross, I leave that game on a lot when I'm not actually doing any of the puzzles. So I will, like, just look at it, do a puzzle, leave it on. So... That happens a lot with Pacross, to be fair. Now, am I saying that I haven't played it for, uh, I don't know, a couple hundred of those hours? No. Just saying. The game does sit there a lot. Yes, Pacross is definitely the idling at work game. And it especially was when I first got obsessed with it. And even now, I still boot it up from time to time. And also, it's a Maro-chan! Hey, Maro, how you doing? How's it going? Oh, God, hello. You've been lurking the whole time playing Genshin with your sister? That's fine. Lurk is allow Lurking's allowed. Say hi when you get a chance. It's all good. Hope you've been having fun playing some Genshin. The Hallow Tree is going okay. It hasn't been the worst thing ever yet, but it could grow to be worse than my current opinion. Ow. Like, this guy could fuck me up. 
Like I need this shit again. These guys in their slow swings, man. Damn it. I should just kill this fool. God, the non-stagger on these bigger ones is annoying. Have I found a boss here yet? Uh, no, not in the Hallow Tree itself, no. The only boss I fought was inside of the, uh, the tunnel that I did earlier. We had to fight another one of those big, weird skull bug creature things. The one that me and you fought together. I was kind of disappointed because I didn't think I was going to see another one of those things. Oh my god, F DJ, Jesus. I was going to make a joke about unemployment, but they just don't work. But, um, tss, nailed it. It's okay. Right now we explore thoroughly, and then if I die, we just run through shit. Explore thoroughly until, you know, we get all the things. No reason to go out that way. I hear a dude walking around. Is he below me? Above me? I hear him. Oh boy. What am I looking at here? I mean... Is he going to drop on my fucking head? Oh, okay. Hello, would you like to come play with me? I just don't know what these guys... I don't recognize these guys. Have I fought these guys? They look like Death Eaters. Fucking Harry Potter-ass Death Eaters. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. I want them to come in here. I don't want to fight them on the bridge. Oh, shit. I didn't realize he was doing the explosive move. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm not dead. How did I not die? I don't think he staggered when I hit him, right? It didn't seem like it. Damn it. Okay. I regret letting two of these guys hang out together. I regret... I regret. If I would have known they were going to not stagger when I hit them, I wouldn't have let two of them hang out together. I would have went YOLO more. Now that I know, I will be more uh, decisive. I am level 147. Oh, shit. I never jumped on this roof. What the heck? Oh, that's right, because I went down and fought those ants. I mean, I don't... Tomorrow. Wouldn't you rely on what works until you find out it doesn't? That's exactly what I've been doing. I don't know why you would even say that. Like, you need to stop relying on your weapon stagger. Why? I do until it doesn't work. Now that I know it doesn't work, then I stop relying on it. The first step is rely on what works. Then when it doesn't, then you change your strength. It's like, like I'm going to listen to... You should stop relying. I'm like, okay, I will when I run into something. Because DJ keeps saying the same shit. I'm like, bruh. I haven't fought one of these guys, have I? These fucking Death Eater looking dudes? If I have, I don't remember where. But anyway. Point is, I didn't know he wasn't going to stagger. But I had to test it. And then once I found out, okay. Well, that's going to be a problem. Again. I can't assume every enemy is not it's not gonna work on, you know what I mean? No, it's me who's assuming it might work by default. I think you're ass backwards in your assumption. I will assume it will work until it doesn't. That's everything ever. Why would 
I don't understand what the argument is here. Why would you not use what works for you until it doesn't? I don't get it. Oh my god. All right, you know what? Why does this happen every time? I can't say, I can't defend my strat without sounding like an asshole. So you know what? I'm just going to go back to playing the game. No, see? No. Nope. Nope. It's different. I'm going to, no. Nope. Nope. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done trying to defend it because there's no reason anymore. Because then I have to explain it and it takes too long and fuck that. Let's just deal with these fucking Death Eaters. Just because we don't all think the same way doesn't mean I'm doing it wrong. Let's just put it that way. I'm not doing it the way you think I should do it. I'm going to go back and watch you guys, or at least Morrow play this at least, and see how y'all did it and go, Hey, look, what you tried didn't work either, did it? Ha ha. Also, am I about to run into a boss right now? I feel like this is a boss arena. Loretta Knight. Oh, Loretta. Oh, Loretta. Haven't we fought you before? We have fought you before. Wow. You didn't even give me a chance to summon my, ho my fucking dogs. What a bitch. I actually didn't even mean to summon my dogs. I meant to summon the other one, but oh well. Right, she was like Loretta's apparition the first time. That is true. So that makes sense. I mean, that's pretty much how this game is felt. We always fight the like fake version first, and then we fight the real one. Anyway, again, I'm not even going to talk about that topic anymore because all I'm going to end up sounding like is an asshole, apparently. So I'm just going to stop. I'm just going to stop. We're just going to keep going with what I'm doing and not going to worry about it anymore. Because what y'all are telling me to do or try or do it a certain way that you think it needs to be tried first, it doesn't make sense. See, now I'm talking about it again. Damn it. Damn it. That's the, that's the point of an open world game, especially. It's played in a way... Okay, for this area. Well, it's part of the game still. Because you clearly are thinking the way you're thinking and I'm thinking the way that I'm thinking, we're not going to agree on anything of what we already talked about. The point is, I'll just try what I try and it works or it doesn't work. That's all that matters. Anyway, I didn't expect to run right to the boss right there. I was going to try and look around before I did that. Oh my god, that explosion is ridiculous, though. Jesus. I just don't want to kill these guys if I'm going to have to keep killing them. You know what I mean? It's one of those enemies I'm going to have to keep re-killing every time I die. There's no reason to kill them. I'm going to do this boss. Fuck it. I'm going to summon my fucking mimic, though. Ay, 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 that did a lot of damage. Jesus. Yeah, I was just waiting for my homie to get in there and actually help, start helping. Oh, cool. I like how I've... He jumped right by me. That was cool. Fuck you, Loretta! Ow. Don't you horse kick me. Oh god, the Loretta's bow is dangerous. We already know this. Oh, they went after me with that? Lame. Oh, jam. The follow-up. Also, damn it, I the delay on that was way more than expected. Kia! Kia! Oh god. Oh god. What are you doing? Oh, oh, don't kill me. Oh, this is a good attempt. I don't want to fuck it up.
Woo, stagger, let's go. Let's go. Oh, God. What is that move? That looked like it was going to murder me in one hit. Woo, suck it, Loretta. Oh, shit. And you actually get the spell for that crazy arrow move. Loretta's War Sickle. Nice. Dude, tag team with myself for the win. Whew. Yeah, who needs a fucking shortcut, Dandy? I agree. That was my second attempt, indeed. You had a bug with this grace where it was misplaced. Okay, well, here's the grace. I don't know if it's bugged out still, but there it is. The first attempt was me walking in, trying to summon my wolves and dying, Sparty, so it wasn't really an attempt. All right, before I continue on past her, I'm going to go back and see if I can find anything over here where those guys were at. And if there was a shortcut somewhere over here, Dandy, I have no idea where it was. But to be fair, I didn't look around all around over here. The Death Eater guys um, made me not want to look around. Nope. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Don't you blow up me. Don't you blow me up. Hero Rune 4. That's cool. Nothing else over here. I don't see a path or a ladder or anything. So I'll just get the fuck out of here. I would appreciate it if you would stop shooting magic at me. All right, what's over here? Is this where the shortcut might be? Ow. I see. I do see an elevator. I think this might be where the shortcut is. So, no, I didn't even see this elevator down here. I was busy focused on those Death Eater fools. So, this leads back to that other grace? Yes, it does. Okay. Good to know. Shortcut open. Don't need it. Who needs it? Loretta got fucked up. Oh, God. Maybe I should have reset these guys. Oh, shiz nuggets. Bye. Bye. They only put shortcuts there for the casuals. Exactly, Sparty. Exactly. <laughs> All right, let me sit at this fucking grace. Yep, 380k runes. About to spend those fuckers right now. Uh, I'm going to put them in strength. I think I really am going to just... Wait, one level up. Yeah, as long as the level actually puts something up... Like, make some stats go up. I'm going to keep doing it. I am a strength build after all. I might go more endurance or health at some point. But right now, strength. I want all of it. I want all the power. I guess I could have teleported over here. What the hell am I doing? I'm a dumb. I just remembered... Uh, you can teleport to any grace in the game. Did you know that, guys? Did you know that? Did you know? <laughs> you don't think any weapon in the game needs more than 60 strength, but more damage is more damage. Yeah, exactly. I don't think so either. Did you know? <laughs> 